Fair event at Duncan Plaza. It was a foot washing ceremony and send off event for a group of New Orleanians preparing to take part in the papal events in Philadelphia. Event organizers tell our Kelsey Davis why it was so important to have this event in New Orleans the same week Pope Francis is in the U.S. Organizer say Pope Francis is truly walking his talk, including some of the most marginalized people in our society today. This event here in Duncan Plaza is their way of showing their solidarity with the Holy Father and hoping to be an example to the rest of the city of New Orleans. This is the day that the Lord has made. The MICA Project, an interfaith, multiracial group of clergy and other community leaders, pushes for social justice in the greater New Orleans area. Ahead of Pope Francis's visit to a correctional facility in Philadelphia, MICA Project members wanted to uplift and include those people who often feel left out in our community. Immigrants, people with criminal records, the homeless, and low-wage workers. The Holy Father has spread a message of love and inclusion worldwide and during his visit here in the U.S. Dr. Mary Green says foot washing is an act we see in the Bible and is one of the most amazing ways to show people in our city who all too frequently feel unimportant or ignored that they do matter. Pope Francis shows that you don't have to drive in a big car, you don't have to wear the best clothes or the most expensive clothes and that you should absolutely get among the people because we know uh, God walked among the people. God was not with the elitists and so he's, he's walking his talk if you will. Dr. Green is one of seven people heading to Philadelphia tomorrow. They're taking part in the Family and Faith Summit this weekend, where Pope Francis is set to speak. Reporting on your side in Duncan Plaza, Kelsey Davis, WDSU News.